Good morning, friends. This is going to be a super comfy one. We are going to do yoga in bed for the morning time. So this is great after a nice night's sleep and you really want a gentle full body stretch but you're not really ready to step on your yoga mat just yet. We can do it from the comfort of our bed. So get super comfy if you're not already. You don't really have to do anything and this class is accessible for all levels. So when you're ready, let's take a moment of stillness and begin. So you can start lying down in your bed or in an easy seat. And before we move or do any type of physical stretching, let's just have gratitude for waking up today. We woke up. We get another day. It's not guaranteed. So let's have some reverence for this time. And don't worry about a to-do list or things that you might need to get done. Gift yourself this time right now just a little chunk of a few minutes so that you can feel good and enter this day from a really nice positive place, having filled up your cup. If they're not already, bring your hands to your thighs and just gently start to rub your thighs with the bottoms of your palms. Creating some heat, but also bringing sensation to your legs, to your fingertips, to your hands. Enlighten your touch and start to self-massage just really gently the rest of your legs, maybe your calf, maybe your foot, even if you're just gently dragging your fingertips over your body. Just a really gentle, sweet way to wake up, to appreciate your body. Thank you legs for standing and holding us up all day. Bring it on up to your hips. Feel the strength and the power of your hips. Give them a nice loving rub. Same for your glutes, one of the strongest muscles in the body. Your abdomen. Having gratitude for your digestive system, your strength from your core. Your chest, your collarbones, your heart center, and rub down one arm. Each of the fingers, and then the other. Just bringing sensation in, gentle wake up. And then start to circle out your wrists. Big circles in one direction. Then the other direction. Nod your wrists up and down as if you're saying, yes, I choose to make today a good day. And then nod them left and right so they're saying no. I will not lean into fear or self-doubt today. And if you're not already seated, gently and slowly come up to a seat. 
place your hands on your thighs or your knees and drop your left ear to your left shoulder nice neck stretch on that right side feel the right side of your neck opening on your exhale drop your chin to your chest and on your inhale your right ear to your right shoulder so these half circles follow with your breath on your exhale down to your chest your inhale brings you up to the other side Maybe after a few slow half rotations, you can make bigger rotations, maybe slightly back, maybe all the way around. A few more just like this, not crunching or pressing. Just moving into open space and trusting that as we move through these gentle movements, our body will open up for us. Especially if it's early in the morning for you, just give yourself some grace. Beautiful. In your easy seat, we'll take cobbler circle. So on your inhale, bring your chest forward, almost arching through the back so your hip bones come up. And on your exhale, chin to chest, round through each vertebrae, hollow out your body. Big inhale brings your chest forward, shoulders away from the ears, look up. Exhale, chin to chest, round through each vertebrae, hollow out your core. Inhale. Shine the chest forward. Maybe you take circles here. <sighs> Bringing your body around to one side. And circling it forward to the other. You can move as slow or as fast as you'd like to. Usually slower is a little bit better in the morning to wake up nice and sweetly. But you do you, boo. And switch the directions. Remembering to inhale as you move forward. And exhale as you round back. Two more. In your easy seat, bring your hands behind you. We're gonna put our weight into our hands, press into our hands, and lift our hips up by squeezing our glutes. Try to lift your hips forward and up. You have the option to drop your head back and really open up through the front chain of your body, this beautiful stretch early in the morning. Breathe and release. Bring your left hand out to your left side. Lean over to the left and our right hand is gonna drop big circles with the entire arm reaching forward, up and back, getting into our chest and our shoulders, which can feel amazing after a nice long night's sleep or a short night's sleep if you didn't get much. Keep reaching through your fingertips. And reverse the circles, bringing them down, then back and forward. And the next time your arm is back, bend through the elbow, cactus the arms, and open the chest up towards the sky. Beautiful. On your next inhale, reach the arm up and over towards the left side of the room. Glue your right hip down to your blankets or your bed and arch up and over like a rainbow. 
Spiral your chest open, look up under your left arm for a nice side body stretch. Breathe, nice and gentle. And inhale, come up. Extend your left leg out, kind of to the side. Pivot your chest over your left leg. Inhale to a really long spine, reach the arms up. Maybe you flex the left foot to activate the leg. And exhale, fold over your leg. You can have a pretty significant bend in your left knee. If you need a little extra space, which I recommend in the morning. And just relax here. Don't judge any depth or this position. Allow your body to just rest and relax here. On your next inhale, come up to an easy seat. Bring your left foot back in. Bring your right hand out to the side and we'll start with our arm circle. So lean over to the right, reach your left arm forward in space and up overhead and back behind you. Pair this to your breath by inhaling the arm up and exhaling the arm down, feeling a beautiful stretch in your shoulder your chest, your back even. And reverse the direction. And next time your arm is back behind you, bend through the elbow, cactus the arm open. So try to bring your elbow towards the mattress, towards your bed, opening through your chest. Beautiful. Inhale, come up to sitting. Extend your right leg. Pivot your chest towards your right leg. Inhale to a long spine, arms rise overhead. And exhale forward, fold. Right foot can be flexed. Right knee can be bent generously. Allow this to stretch through your right hamstring, your right calf. Breathe deep. On your next inhale, slowly come up. Bring the bottom of the feet together for butterfly pose. Doesn't really matter how far away your feet are from your body. Inhale to that really long spine. Maybe you grab onto your ankles and exhale, lean forward with that same long spine. Pressing your elbows into your knees, trying to shine your chest forward towards the ground. Oftentimes in the morning, a little bit of movement in a static position can feel good. So feel free to pull yourself forward. Just a little micro movement, just a pulse forward to find a little bit of deeper space. And then back off, never staying at a really intense stretch. 
where our body will try to lock up in its fight or flight mode. We always want to keep it calm and feeling safe so that it can open up for us. Three more breaths here, make them full. Release, come up, take an easy seat, easy legs, and shrug your shoulders up to your ears. Nice big inhale. On your exhale, let them fall down your back. Two more times, just like that. Inhale, up to your ears, and exhale, roll them down your back. A little bit bigger this time, inhale. Exhale, roll them down your back. This one's different. Inhale, both arms up. Look up, reach through each arm. And on your exhale, cactus your arms open, bent at the elbows, all the way down until they connect behind your back, clasping hands. And open through the chest, pressing your chest towards the sky. Your collarbones are rising. Keep the ribs in, so knit the ribs down towards your hip bones. Try to bring this into your thoracic spine, the upper spine. For three. For two. For one. Release. And we will come down to our backs. So see if you can do it nice and slow with control. Come down for five, four, a little bit of core work, three, two, maybe hold that two, and then release down. Beautiful. We'll take our right leg over our left knee. So our right ankle is stacked on top. We're coming into a figure four position and inhale that all up. Bring both arms behind your left thigh. So one will go in between that little triangle that you created with your right leg. And relax your spine onto your bed. Really feel the imprint of your spine being supported. You have the option here to straighten your left leg for a deeper stretch. Pull it all in towards your chest. If your left leg is straight, rebend it and release the bottom of your right foot to the left side. So we're taking a twist. You can stay like this, or you can curtsy your legs where you actually cross your right leg under your left leg. Reach your right arm out and look to the right. Nice little spinal twist in the morning, breathe. As you breathe here, I want you to bring in one word for your day. It can be an intention, a reminder, whatever you need. The first word that came to me today, and I'm going to trust my intuition on this, and you can borrow my word, is flow. Meaning to go with the flow of how today unfolds and find joy in whatever it brings. Two more breaths here.
Beautiful. Start to come up back into your figure four. Give it one more squeeze in. And then extend both legs towards the sky. Reach the toes up. Then flex the feet, reach the heels up. Feel how that changes the sensation. Reach the toes up. Then flex the foot, reach the heel up. One more time, reach the toes up and connect the bottom of the feet and externally rotate both legs so the knees are now pointing out to the side. Feel how that's different. Then bring the tops of the feet back towards your face. Flex the foot, reach the heel towards the sky. Beautiful, relax your feet. Maybe shake them out a little bit. Come into a figure four on the left side. So your left ankle is right on top of your right knee, a few inches above that on your thigh. You can bend your right knee, bring it all into your chest, feel a beautiful glute stretch and an IT band stretch on the left. You can straighten out your right leg to bring in a hamstring stretch on the right. Just listen to your body here. Having deep, full breaths. Bringing in a little bit closer, perhaps. And if your right leg is straight, you can re-bend it. Release everything to the left side, or excuse me, the right side. So the left foot is coming down to the right side of your mat for a twist. And if you want to, you can take the full cross leg Reach your left arm out to the left side and look to the left. Notice where you might be clenching or holding. See if you can release. At the same time, we can bring that concept off the mat, not always trying to grip and bend things and make them how we want them to be, but to soften around them, and in doing so we can find a deeper expression. We can find a little bit more joy, a little bit more contentment when we're, we're not battling, or clenching, or forcing. Inhale, breathe both legs up towards the sky. One more time, reach the toes skyward, almost as if your legs are coming out of your hips, almost as if you're bending or posterior tilting your hips up. So your navel's coming in. Reach, reach, reach. And then flex your foot. Reach your toes back towards your face. Energy coming out of your heels towards the sky. And then peace fingers can grab big toe or hands can grab pinky side of the foot. Bend both knees. Happy baby. The full of the spine is supported by the bed. Bring the knees down towards your bed or the floor. Beautiful hamstring and groin stretch. Feel free to straighten the legs if you feel like you have the space to do so right now or gently rock from side to side. Just play in this position. Doesn't have to be too serious. And when you're ready, you can release by coming into an easy seat or bring the bottom of the feet together and relax them onto the bed in Supta Baddha Konasana. (sighs) 
Bring your prayer hands to your third eye. May we honor our thoughts. Prayer hands to your lips. May we honor the words we speak. Prayer hands to your heart center. May we honor ourselves. Namaste, sweet friends. As you move through today, first, I hope you feel good and open, and I hope you incorporate movement into your day. But I also hope you bring in that word that you chose to to move through today with, and I hope that that's integrated. And go ahead and comment your word below. I love to hear what you chose. And if you didn't have one, one didn't come to mind, feel free to use mine, which is flow. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and I'll see you on the mat soon. Bye friends.